Hi, my name is Tazel Shamming, and I am a graduate student at the Cornell Lab of Ornithology in the Department of Natural Resources, and I'm going to show you how to properly monitor a nest box. This is a tree swallow nest box. When you open a box, you just want to open it up, look inside, see how many eggs and or young there are, and then close it right back up. You want to create as little disturbance as possible. When I first walk up to a nest box, what I want to do is tap on the outside to give the adult a chance to leave if there is an adult inside. Looks like no one's here. So I'm going to open this tree swallow box and we have four baby tree swallows. Four tree swallow chicks. These are probably about a week old. When you monitor a box, you don't want to touch the chicks. You don't want to touch the eggs. You usually are going to spend less than a minute at each of the boxes. And don't forget that you want to check them in the afternoon and when it's pretty good weather. You don't want to check them if it's cold weather or if it's poor weather, if it's raining. And when you leave the box, make sure to keep walking in a different direction so that you create a continuous line and you're not creating a dead end which predators will follow directly to the nest box. Okay, now that I've just checked that box and walked a little bit away, I need to write down a little bit of information. I need to make sure to write the date. It's June 10th. The time, it's 3 p.m. The number of eggs, which is zero. The number of live young, which is four. The nest status, which is complete nest. Therefore, I'm going to write CN. Adult activity, which is none. And PY, because the young are partially feathered. There's no management activity and my initials. Now the only thing left to do is when I get home tonight, I'm going to enter this into the Nest Watch database.